My name is Pedro Lichtinger. Uh, I am a long-term pharma and biotech executive. I, I have spent most of my career at Pfizer, where I was the president of Europe and the president of Global Primary Care. I co-founded uh, ChemioCare in May of 19, I'm sorry, of 2017. And uh, our objective is to transform the quality of life of, of patients that are undergoing chemotherapy. Uh, patients, um, unfortunately, when they get chemotherapy, in addition to having the opportunity of survival, they get very severe side effects. One of the most important is vomiting and nausea. In fact, even after taking three medicines at the same time to attempt to control the vomiting, in the high risk of vomiting patient population, we get up to 50% of them continuing to vomit and up to 5% abandoning their therapy and actually being on a path to death as a result of that. So we believe that a, our proprietary a reformulation through the transdermal technology that we own will allow those, similar, those same products to be more effective and have lower side effects so that the quality of life of those patients is significantly improved and we create value for them and for our shareholders. Well, the most important milestones for us is we have been successful in completing the formulation of our first patch. We have four patches in development. The first one is complete and that patch it was mentioned by major corporations as not being feasible. So we are very proud that we have completed it and that we're now moving it into proof of concept trials. It is important to highlight we don't have phase one, phase two. We jump directly to phase three trials and that is only because we want to have superiority on the label and conduct the clinical trials that will con convince the FDA and other regulatory authorities around the world that we have a superior offer for the patient. Uh, we are very lucky to have with us our chief medical officer. Uh, he, he is um, uh, in the United Kingdom and he was the developer of two of the most successful products in this field. He conducted all of the clinical trials, went to the registration, and launched two pro products in the chemotherapy-induced emesis field. So we have a very experienced um, a chief medical officer with a proven track record in an area where it's very difficult to find talent. Uh, beyond that, we have our head of research and owner of the lab that is developing the patches, has spent 45 years in transdermal technology. He has published over 100 papers in this specific field and has built a field, a, a, a lab with a three PhDs and is exclusively working for us. So that is a major strength for, for our company. Well, the key message, uh, th this is a, a company that is in its early phase of development. Our valuation at this point is relatively low. Uh, we are raising uh, 6 to $11 million. In nine months only, we intend to go through an IPO when we expect an increase of valuation of 6 to 10 times our current value. In addition to that, once we go through the IPO, we will be conducting the clinical trial and uh, would expect to either sell the company or partner it at that time and have an increase in valuation again. I think it's been very interesting for me. Uh, we have identified several uh, institutions and individuals that are interested in investing in our company. We will be following up with them and uh, I have been very pleasantly surprised with the amount of capital that is readily available for biotechnology in, in Hong Kong and the interest in our company.